house results to Sabra Shanukan. Today's Facebook Live video is all about getting your house priced right from the very start. The day, the day you, select, you select your starting price for your property is make or break time. Getting the best price and doing so quickly requires sound strategy. Sellers may be torn between two approaches. A. Price your house lower in order to generate viewing activity or B. Start higher so you can always come down. Both approaches, both approaches have their place depending when you sell and both carry risks. I always believe in getting the price right from the very, very start to generate interest to, in order to create the most powerful strategy for your property to obtain the highest price. In a rising market, it is always better to put your home at a competitive market value to tease the buyers into your home. We've got, we've got to tease the buyers in in order, in order for them to view your property and to get their creative juices flowing. If your property is overpriced, buyers will not look at your property. A great indication that your property is overpriced if you're not generating viewing activity with your agent of choice. Sometimes a property can receive viewings but no offers. If this is happening, the property could be A, either poorly presented or B, overpriced. When a property is priced, quite, priced correctly, offers should be coming to that particular property. If you set your price too high, you will always have to drop, drop the price in time, um, which doesn't look good on the website. So you're better off pricing your property correctly in order to, in order to generate the, the correct viewing activity. So get it right from the start. Engage a strong, reliable agent. They will in turn generate a buzz in the marketing for your property, fire up your viewing activity for your property, generate multiple bids on your property to generate a higher price for you, achieve a great price that both you and your property deserve. So a few bullet points here, so let's just try to remember everything. If you're thinking of selling your house this season, this is a great time to sell. As the weather's getting better, we've a stretch in the evenings, the flowers are in bloom, people are starting to cut their grass again, and there's great energy and positivity about the, about the property market. There is a huge shortage of houses still for sale, and there's a huge volume of buyers looking to buy your property, I'm sure. Um, so if you're thinking of selling, this is exactly what you need, would, you need to do. I would always rec recommend any vendor get three good agents out to value your property. Um, you should investigate A, their market share, B, evidence of the recent sales in the, in the area, C, their success rate and past performance. Have they won industry awards? D, how long have they been in business? Were they the strong agents that survived the recession? Um, they, the, 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 the agents that survived the, the recession really are a, a testament to themselves and are highly, highly experienced and can deal with every scenario that your property may come across. You should Google them and the reputation. Be warned, however, of these trolls. They're very evil. Uh, they say awful things about people that are not true. So in general, Google people, but obviously look at the, if the vast reviews are very, very good, uh, pay heed to them. If there are you know, a few negative ones, you, you, it's not always good to read into that either because it's not fair. It, doesn't, it may not give a general overview of your agent of choice. It's very, very important to see if your members are affiliated uh, auctioneering body. You should ask to see their auctioneer's license to make sure they're professionally identified and qualified to do what they do. Um, it's very, very important as well. See how their phones are answered in the office when you ring up to inquire, um, could the agent do a valuation for you? Just see how the, the, the lady or the gentleman answers the phones. Um, are they efficient? Are they friend, friendly? Are they helpful? Are they organised? Uh, the devil is always in the detail. Interview your agents. You should always interview people, bring them out to your property, let them see your property. Um, you must feel comfortable with your agent of choice as well. That's very, very important. Um, your gut is also a great thing as well when you interview these agents. You, you, need, to, you need to go with somebody who you, you know you can trust. Is your agent honest, sincere, positive, motivated and enthusiastic? If they're not enthusiastic about your property, they're not going to be able to sell your property for you. So it's very, very important uh, that they're motivated, enthusiastic and energetic. Um, you must realise this as well, your, your agent can make a massive difference to the price you actually eventually get for your property. So be very, very careful with your selection because it can make a difference of tens of thousands to you. Um, very, very important, don't go with an agent who overvalues your property to get your business and gives you the cheapest fee. Cheaper is oftentimes not better. You're not paying for someone to negotiate, you're paying for somebody to negotiate your, your most expensive asset. So it's very, very important that you do engage the, the, the strongest agent. Um, so just, just be very, very careful because sometimes agents overvalue property and charge the cheapest fee to get the property on their books. But um, this is not always um, the best 
type of agent to run with. Um, so that's it. So basically just remember to nail it from the start, price your property correctly, don't overvalue from the start, get a good strong reputable agent. Um, obviously if you can get somebody recommended to you, it's very, very um, powerful for you as well. And um, that's it. Good luck everybody. Um, if you want your home valued, we'd love to be one of the agents um, that we come up and talk to you about your property. Um, you can email us at office at teamrain.e or directly to me at rain at teamrain.e. We're looking for houses to sell. We have a lot of properties on our books at the moment and many properties are getting super, super offers. We have a lot of properties after going sold, so we are looking for stock and we'd love to uh, arrange to meet with you at a time that's convenient to you at your property. Thanks a million. Bye. Oh, it's still alive. Okay, thank you. Hi, Chuck.